pay marks. You don't get to join us for our show anymore. Unless you come on the table, which you're more than welcome to, I guess. <clears throat> Look at him. She's like, all right. Okay. Up here, Mars. Come on. Ready? We're recording. Don't knock anything over. <laughs> and go. Welcome to Brandon and Brandon. Actually, I forgot to do the thing. No, it's okay. Welcome to Brandon. It's top five with Brandon and Brandon. Oh, yeah. okay. Three, two, go. Welcome to the top five with Brandon and... Brandon! Yeah. We're, we're a couple of Brandons over here. And we're both going to have uh, possible health issues after this episode. Maybe. What are we doing, kiddo? We like to call these snacky cakes. Yeah, we got like the hostess and the uh, little Debbie stuff. It's pretty much hostess versus Twinkies. little Debbie. So we got what Twinkies? Yeah. Zebra cakes. Whatever these things are. Birthday cupcakes from Hostess. Oatmeal cream pies and cosmic brownies from Little Debbie. So basically. We went to Target, and I said to him, pick out five of these snacky cakes from the snacky cake aisle. And, and how do you like our new set? All the money from the literally tens of thousands of likes and subscribes that we've got for this show. Subscribes. Subscribes. <laughs> uh, now we can afford to uh, do like better production. Yes. Actually, all that's a lie. None of you people are watching. What's going on? Come on. It's a, it's a very cute dad and his cute kid and a cute cat eating things. It's perfect for YouTube. You should be out there just like, I gotta like this six times. Anyways, you ready to get started? And I'm making a promise to you and to Marcy Cat and to you at home that I'm not gonna screw up the... <coughs> <coughs> you sneezed on my cat. <laughs> Why would you do that? I'm not going to mess up the scorecards ever again. Ever. Do you believe me? No. All right. Well, where are we starting off here? Uh, just, let's just go right. Old-fashioned Twinkies. You know, for a while there, they stopped making Twinkies. And then I guess Hostess said, well, that was stupid because there was a public outrage and uh, Twinkies came back. But before we bite into these uh, delicious, foamy whatever these things cream filled things are smells really good how do we score these things what are we even doing here right now it's the top five we score them one through five including halves so one in, or one and a half would be pretty terrible three three and a half would be mediocre and four and a half and five would be amazing and we may get some amazings but I, here's the thing i don't eat a lot of this stuff i don't think i've had any of these in my, like in decades, seriously, so I'm kind of... I've only had two of these. Cheers. But you never guess how they put the, the, the cream filling in the Twinkie, huh? I want to see that happen. Is there like footage? Maybe I'll, if, there, if we can find footage of Twinkies being made, I'm going to insert it right here. Since we're doing like super production, we're going to insert things now. Yeah, you want to like how it's made or something. Yeah, it'd be like, and then right back to us eating a Twinkie, I guess. Are you ready for this? Hey. Here we go. You damaged my Twinkie. I used to eat these as a kid like crazy. I don't know. Yeah. I still don't like those. It's still familiar. I don't think the recipe has changed. You don't like it? Yeah, I still don't like it. I've only had Twinkies once. I did not like it back then, and I do not like what it now. What don't you like about it? it tastes really cheap. <laughs> it really is cheap. They are cheap. I mean, you get two for in a package for like like I don't know fifty cents. Or, I, I've, I've not bought Twinkies forever. I bought a box because we needed the display. But mm -hmm. it's good. But my complaint is it's just so sugary. It's just so sugary. Yeah, I think it would be better if there's, if there's more bread and less cream. That may be true. Yeah, actually, there's one thing that I do like, yes. and I'm kind of bummed we don't have them here. You want a Twinkie, Marcy? Lick, lick the cream off of it. Okay. Uh, a Zingers. Zingers is basically a Twinkie. <laughs> but it has like a layer of icing on top. And I really like Zingers. But uh, what are you going to give this one? Twinkies. I give it a two. 
two, I guess. The two for the sun. I'm going to go ahead and give it a two and a half. So you, are you catering to kitten needs? Mm -hmm. I thought she wanted to be on the show. She was talking yeah, about it all like, day. Like, <laughs> she smelled that Twinkie. She's like, there's nothing here for me. Okay, so we're giving it a four and a half for Twinkies. Boom. What's next? Uh, so keep going right with the uh, zebra cakes. I think is what they're called. Zebra cakes. I actually remember eating quite a bit of these as a kid. I like to eat some zebra cakes. So I haven't had them on in a long time, though. I've never had one of these. Do you know why they call them zebra cakes? Because they're an octagon. Are they an octagon? UFC should not. It's like a no, six-sided, which is a... pentagon. The pentagon is five-sided. Six-sided is... Uh, Alexa, what is a six-sided object? According to another Amazon customer, a five-sided shape is called a pentagon. I said six-sided. sided six-sided shape is a hexagon. Oh, a hexagon. Okay. Shape I'm already arguing with her and she wasn't done yet. Okay, sides. Alexa, stop. There are names for many... Oh, she just goes off on, just on a tangent. She just knows everything, apparently. Okay, zebra cakes. They're called zebras because they got little strips of fudge on top of icing on top of cake. Inside, there's cream. I think I'll like this one so a lot. It's like Twinkie with uh, more sugar. It's, it's just all straight sugars. All, all of this. There's, that's number one ingredient. Let me guess. Sugar. Number one ingredient. Bleached flour and sugar. Number one ingredient. Bleached flour and niacin. Iron and wow, well, corn syrup. Okay. Sugar, water, and rich flour. Yeah, it's a uh, it's a bunch of dough and sugar. Don't eat this stuff. Let us do the eating, and then uh, did you already take a bite? No. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Mm-hmm. I like the zebra cakes. They're better than the Twinkie, but still. Absolutely. You don't like it? After it tastes terrible. You are like not the normal thirteen kid, thirteen year old kid. I won't eat the whole thing. I'll give it a two again. You give it a two? Yeah. I'm going to give that one, a, I'm going to give it a three. So a total of five for zero, out of ten for zebra cakes. I need a, I need water or I'm going to pass out. I know you're not watching us to watch us drink water, but trust us, it's for our own safety. What's next? It's our birthday. Birthday cake. It's birthday cake. Now the normal cupcakes that Hostess makes have the chocolate with the little white squiggly line and chocolate cake, but we picked out this one because it's got sprinkles. Yeah. And I'm not a big chocolate cake fan, so. Me neither. I do like mm. cupcakes, so. Mmm. I could give it a 10 for the smell, but oh, there's also cream inside of this one. Now, when you think cupcakes, you're thinking of all these like artsy fartsy ones that you get at the cupcake shops down the street. It's not this isn't a cupcake, okay? This is just Basically a Twinkie with different stuff on it. It's kind of like when you go to Taco Bell. Like everything on Taco Bell is made with the same six ingredients. That's what Hostess does as well. It's just different shapes, sizes, and. That one's good though. Hmm. Save that one for later. <laughs> well, you got a box of them here. I mean, that is pretty good. It's the same cream here. as a Twinkie. Yeah. Exactly. And uh. I'm dropping things off my cupcake. It's so sugary though. You're going three? Yeah. I'm gonna go. I'll go three. I can't, I can't. It's so sugary. I'm just not that guy anymore. It's funny because when you're an adult, you like certain things. When you're a kid, it's completely different. I could have eaten everything in each one of these boxes all in the same sitting when I was a kid. Now I'm already hurting and we got two things to go. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we're on to the Little Debbie. Little Debbie Oatmeal Cream Pies. Now, these are amazing. This is something me and my grandmother used to eat together. She'd always have a box of these things, and I'd eat most of them, and she'd get mad at me because they were gone. You gotta smell it first, though, because it just smells really good. Mm. I love oatmeal cookies. I, I, I love oatmeal cookies. And this is basically too. two oatmeal cookies. You like oatmeal cookies? Yeah. I didn't know that. Okay, let's go get some oatmeal cookies. Oh, I guess we have a box. Oh, we're doing another episode with a bunch of cookies, so we have like. Oh, we do have a cookie episode like, coming up. We have like seventy. Oh, like, uh, it's not okay. In the back. Inside, there's a little bit of cream. Outside, it's uh, blanketed by two oatmeal cookies. You're excited about this one. I love me oatmeal cookies. <laughs> <laughs> I 
God hit. I love my. Oh. <laughs> You're like rolled down my arm. All right, <laughs> count the cat hairs on there now. Are you? <laughs> Do you want another one? We have plenty. No. Okay, I'll break mine in half because I'm not going to eat it all. Okay, here we go. Oatmeal cream cookies from Little Debbie. And here's a strange fact about Little Debbie. They only show her like from the from the neck up. From the neck down, she's Big Debbie because she's been eating all this stuff for a long time. I'm not fat shaming you, Debbie. I'm just saying that, you know, it's a little deceptive. I think Debbie's dead. Debbie's probably long dead of she many like in the, in the prairie heart days. related <laughs> problems. <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh, look at that. Mmm. That is really good. I may be a little dampened from all the sugar we just ate before it. It may have uh, bleached out my mouth a little bit because it's not as like boom as I thought it was going to be. But it's a good thing that it's not that way. It's no, not they're just not like that. It's not a sugar. I've been eating these my whole life. I know. I know what I like. I have been too. Mm. I'm going to give it a ah, three and a half. Same. You choking over there? No. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's a seven for oatmeal cream cookies. Now they're gonna win unless these little Debbie cosmic brownies are just absolutely freaking phenomenal. Are you excited about little Debbie cosmic brownies? These are not normal brownies. They come from the cosmos. They're ah. Cosmic. There was an asteroid that passed our Earth and it just flew off and went ah, boom, bro. Oh my god. <laughs> Jeez. There's little sprinkles on it. Those are ast uh, 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 what do you call it? Moon rocks. I guess that's what makes them cosmic. Yeah. It's just a. All right, so I've had a lot of these too as well. You've had these before? I've never had these. They're a little overwhelming to the bit where you can't do much. Like too sugary. You'll this, see. You'll see. This might be good with like a scoop of ice cream on it. Like if you want to make a brownie fudge sundae or something. All right, here we go. I'm gonna make sure I get a lot of moon rocks in there because they're cosmic. Mm. See what I mean? Well, that's the first chocolatey thing we've had. So that stands out. It's not bad. I mean, it's straight sugar and chocolate, but what sugar is kind of straight chocolate. I don't like them. You said you've had a bunch of them. I said I had them, not a bunch. Oh. I've had a bunch of oatmeal. I'm going to give that a two and a half. I'll give it a two. Two. So. All right. I think we did good here. I think we gave an honest assessment. There's only one tie in score, and that's with four and a half points. Cosmic Brownies are tied with the Twinkies. Boom. And that's tied in fifth and fourth place. Those are going to go to homeless people or something. In third place. I actually thought these would go higher, but Zebra Cakes are in Zebra. third place. Zebra cakes are in third place from Little Debbie. And now it's down to uh, Little, De uh, Little Debbie versus Hostess. It's the birthday cupcakes versus the oatmeal cream pies. And in second place is... This one. Yes, Hostess, I'm sorry. But you came in second, and that's nothing to be upset about. The birthday cake um, cupcakes. <laughs> There's so much sugar in there. Which means... It means he gets to dance now with... The, with this means we got the oatmeal cream pies. Creme. I like the way you say creme. Creme de la creme. Oatmeal cream pies are our winner for today. I'm going to take one last bite in celebration. Oh god. Okay, no more sugar. Mm. Alright, well I'm dying over here. Tell people what they should do if they have a recommendation for us. If you have a recommendation for what we could try next, then leave a comment. And remember to like and subscribe. And hit the notification bell, too, because we do a lot of these. And uh, YouTube will be like, hey, there's a new top five with Brandon and Brandon. Or any of the other shows. You've got your BB Oxmauser show on there where you travel all over the country doing awesome stuff. You've got your Dead Zombie show on there where you're playing zombie video games. 
I've got Go There, Eat That, which is like a big time show from Asai TV where I travel all over the place eating things. You disappeared. Should we put Marcy Cat's show on there too? She's got, she actually has a show which is for a TV for cats. Anyway, I also do my Funko Pop show, Pop Goes to Brandon. There are a lot of shows on here on the life of Brandon, and that's both of us, both both Brandon. And uh, we need you to uh, like and subscribe and all that stuff. So until next time, I'm gonna go make sure I don't have diabetes now. Yeah, my teeth hurt. Say bye, Marcy Cat.